live in this city, cry. What is going on, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Breezy Eric the Easier Serious Server. Back with another video, man. We ain't gonna stop, man. But if y'all new to the channel, y'all already know what to do, man. Give this video a like, give the video a comment, subscribe to the channel if you're new, man. We're in a road to 6k subs, we're almost there. We're like 100 away. My goal is to hit 10k by December. So if y'all new to the channel, man, I welcome you guys, man. It's all love. And um, yeah, subscribe to the channel, help the kid out, reach 6k subs. We're almost there. But today, man, I decided I wanted to learn some slang, some African lingo. You know what I'm saying? So it's only right to react to a, a video is called uh, South African South African slang. You know what I'm saying? So if some of these slangs are wrong, if I'm, if, and, and if you're from South Africa, comment below and correct them. You know what I'm saying? I would love to learn some new things. But um, let's get it. Channel, we welcome you, and if you are returning, thank you so much for your love and support. We love you guys. Love, 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 and appreciate you. So today, what we are doing is. We are all in quarantine, other countries are in lockdown, and all we keep seeing on social media is people wanting to travel after COVID-19. Me included. And myself included. <laughs> so if you do land yourself in South Africa, our magical country, you're going to have to know hmm. a bit of these words. We are teaching you South African slang. Yeah. Okay, so I'm a, a, a little bit nervous because I haven't seen the words. You'll be fine. Are you sure? I don't Take know. a crystal ball. It's going to give you all mm. the luck. <laughs> I mean, guys, as you know, we do have 11 official languages in South Africa, but that's a lot. It's just that's a crazy. Words. If you know these, you will be able to get around in whichever province you are at. Yeah, so you understand. Okay, cool. All right. Let's so I'm going to pick the words and say it, and then we can start explaining it to our understanding. Okay, okay. All right. So I'll pick the first one. Oh, this is the big one also. Bride, it had to be the first one, guys. <laughs> bride is like okay in America it's called barbecue. Even in Europe they call it a barbecue, okay? Really? Like parent. Barbecue? Okay, so bride, bride. Okay, I believe it's like Afrikaans word. Um it's like when you have the barbecue. Yes, but it's different. It, it slaps differently, bro. Yeah, no. Like the vibe. It's, it's slaps, different. It's different. Like in South Africa we call it a bride. Let's have a bride. It's like a vibe. It's, a, it's not just like a bride. It's like a vibe. It's like a vibe. Like like uh -huh. And then yeah. the season. A bride is like a vibe, you know what I'm saying? So, yo, let's, let's go catch a vibe. I mean, I guess eat, drinks, shit like that, you know what I'm saying? That's dope. That's dope. The name of the meat also. Well, you wouldn't know. Well, I wouldn't know, but I know the vibe. <laughs> the snack. I know the chakalaka. Oh, oh, so yeah. If you are South African, or if you've been to South Africa and you South African speaking of a bride, you know this is a good one. Yeah, <laughs> so it's a whole vibe. You gotta choose the next one. No, I'm choosing all of them. Oh, yeah, because you don't know the words. Okay, this one it, it can be said like in many ways. But the most common is my China, Maybe, or my Chong. Okay, yeah. <laughs> that's like that's my friend. You know? That's how we call friends. Yeah, so yeah. Like she's my Chomi. Yeah, so It's like saying homie, yo, that's my Chomi, you feel me? Yo, that's my chomi. That's good to know when I travel over there, you know what I'm saying? That's my chomi. Mm. This would be like my chomi. Yeah. And then my China is like a... My China is across the board. Yeah. And then Meiru is like the colors, the yeah. colors, yeah. you know? Yeah. It's a nice one. I like that one. <laughs> my China. China. Oh, you can say chomam, mm. you know? Oh, no. Wow. Sure. The next one is actually a very new one in the vocabulary of, uh, you know, mm -hmm. South what Africa. Is, what is it? Dololo. <laughs> when you don't know. No, oh, you don't know. have. It's nothing. Yeah. It just literally know. means nothing. <laughs> I went to Publix or Walmart or ShopRite to get a bottle of wine. A Dololo wine. <laughs> yeah, so that is that just okay. means nothing. Means nothing. Yeah. yeah, okay. I like it. Okay, are you confused? No, I'm not confused, but like, um... Don't, no, no. It's definitely that. Okay. You're recently in a magical yeah. country. Yeah, like, I love this one. What's that one? Joel. Joel. Okay, let me just address something, guys. Let's see if he hangs around a certain time with people, and I hang around a certain time with people. <laughs> the types of words we use in our circles are different. <laughs> I don't use Joel, but I know Joel. Yeah. Joel is like fun, right? How was the party? It was a joke. Yeah, like it was, it was too much. I could tell, like, the one to the right is more, it's more in tune, it's more hip, it's more out there, you know what I'm saying? 
she's more in the mix when it comes to things, you know what I'm saying? She seems, the one to the left seems like she's more conservative, you know what I'm saying? Like more, how do I say this? Like, she's more like, it's to herself, more, she hangs out with select fewer people, you know what I'm saying? So certain lingo won't really make sense to other people because she speaks a certain, I guess, like a certain way, you know what I'm saying? Because she hangs out with certain people, certain type of people. If that makes sense, you know. But. Much fun. That's not a typical word for me. It's not used in my circle. <laughs> but you're not going to get to some of these lines. I love it. But if you were to express like that the party was nice or something was nice. That shit was dope. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it was a joke. Yeah. Out here in the states, or like you know, what I'm saying, um, basically all around the world, they say though. But we'd be like, yo, that shit was a movie. That means it's it's probably the best event you ever been to. So if you guys watch this video, man, or Joel in America is basically like saying, movie. It, it was it was crazy. It was a movie. You know what I'm saying? Let's continue. Yeah. 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 Patkos. Patkos is like food and snacks that you pack when you're going on a road trip. These words are your support. Patkos. These are your support. Like snacks. Patkos is like a pavo. Yeah. A pavo. Literally, patkos yeah. is how, it, it's an Afrikaans term. It's literally, hmm. it means food for the road. Pad is Pad -kos. road. Kos is food. Actually, even the kos is used. We use it. Yeah, we I use it across the board. Yeah. You know, I was having a conversation with uh, my and she heard me speaking on the phone and I was explaining something or telling somebody a story and I'm like, Gandhi. And she's like, you guys use that term too? That's a colored term. I'm like, no, so see, Gandhi is gone. Meanwhile, Gandhi back at the ranch. Meanwhile, back at the ranch. You know what I mean? She's like, really? I'm like, babe, don't be stealing all words. She's like, we use it a lot. Anyway, the next one is, uh, it's also a new one. so many different dialect different languages different pronunciations like it is dope man definitely definitely the continent africa you know what i'm saying there's so many languages in that continent man and um one word can mean so many other words you know what i'm saying it's pretty dope but um let's get back to the video you need to know if you're going to be partying out in South Africa, fam, like, 
<laughs> you need to when you go to the store, you yeah. like hey, and they know exactly how to fix that one. Okay, the next one is a song. A song. It's a sandwich. I don't know. You don't know it. <laughs> she looks like she doesn't know a lot of things. I'm not sure what part of Africa these girls are from. But if they're saying South African slang, then I would assume they're both from South Africa. Who knows? Maybe not. Let's see. Basically, I'm going to tell you in this way. Basically, okay, it's not as common, but basically, a sami is a sandwich. Like, when you buy a sandwich at a store, you buy a turkey sami, a pastrami sami. Sami. Okay, we skip that one because my dearest friend here does not relate. I don't know. Again, maybe it's my circle. I don't know. Ah, dude. Ooh, this one is actually not a nice one. That is, you do not use this word mm. uh, in South Africa, just in Okay, but you will hear the word, especially in places like taxi ranks and stuff like that. This one I will know. What's the word? <laughs> 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 yeah, it's a very... Yeah, don't use that word. Don't use that word. Yeah, don't laugh on your face. Yeah. Don't use that word. It's a very dismissive term, normally used to get rid of a dog. Like yeah. 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 So when somebody <laughs> says protect to you, you must know. Ah, yeah, it's not. This, yeah, so it's this is what I'm going to advise you guys. Understand the word, but don't let it come out of your mouth. <laughs> you gonna yeah? Don't use that one. That one is a lot. <laughs> okay, we're coming to the end of the video really soon. <laughs> this one I use a lot, and I'm sure my American friends or my new circle in America has heard me say this a lot. What's the word? I I will. I use Ivo for everything. I will. <laughs> my husband does that word. <laughs> my husband actually made me realize that my mom uses the word a lot. I use this word a lot. It's actually a term. It's like it's a it's phrase that you use when you express yeah, when you're expressing something that's like wow. Like, you are surprised. Like I will. I will. You can use it. Yeah. <laughs> or, I use it a lot when I'm surprised. To my surprise, right? Basically, I will be like similar to like that ass like. You serious? Like in, in New York, we would be like, "Oh, you dead ass? Are you serious?" Like you know, must be like like you surprised. But oh shit, you dead ass. <laughs> yeah, and I think also with Ivo, it's the way you say it. Yeah, exactly. Because you can say Ivo, like like oh my gosh, something bad is about yeah. to happen. Ivo, or you can say Ivo, like oh my gosh, like you know, or you can be like Ivo. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so it's actually a Zulu. Yeah, it is. I think it's, it is a music video. Yeah. Mm. Are you liking the... I mean, I'm liking the... And you're learning. Exactly. What do you know? I mean, it's a long year. I'm going to say it's a long year, because that's... <laughs> but it's hard, guys. Guys, you got it wrong. She's going... Salami is a type of meat. What's the word? Salami. <laughs> you were like, ah, I don't know. Ah, 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 and you said you get to get down to this one? <laughs> okay, this is also an Afrikaans term. Yeah. But I feel like it's used across the board because I'm not Afrikaans, but I use what it. What is it? Aina. Oh, that's like, ouch. Aina. Like when you, Aina. Yeah, like you cut yourself like off. Aina. Yeah. yeah, it's pain. It, it's an expression um, to express pain. Yeah. 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 When you go to her. Yeah, no, Aina. Aina. This Aina. Is, I didn't study Afrikaans. It's just a language I'm used to. Yeah, me too. The thing is, I studied Afrikaans from... I come from an Afrikaans area. Yeah, that's why it's easier. It's easy to be. Oh, this one I like it. It's also an Afrikaans term. What is it? Lekka. 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 Yo, this one also, it's an expression when someone is like really, really angry, it's also in Afrikaans. Khanen, you my woe. Are these words all in Afrikaans? No, but these are common words. Khatbo. This is when you're like Gatbo. over it. Like you've had enough. Yeah. You've had Gatbo. enough, you are angry, yeah. you, you've just had enough, you are Khatbo. Yeah. <laughs> so you know that one. Yeah, I know that one. Oh, I like this one. I use this one a, a lot. How is it? Make sure you guys comment below to make sure that they're actually saying 
uh, these words and it actually makes sense. You know what I'm saying? Cause I feel like for different parts, I mean, diff I guess in different parts of Africa, people understand it differently. You know what I'm saying? So comment below, let your boy know that. You know, this is actually like the meaning of these words. You know what I'm saying? So I won't be saying the wrong shit when I go over there. <laughs> That's also Afrikaans. No, but we use it. Like, how's it? It's how's it? Yeah, how's it? Like, how's it? 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 Yeah, in Cape Town, in, in Soweto, you'll get a different, like, shop shop shop, you know? Oh no, I had shop shop, but I didn't cut it. Yeah, but no shop shop. Yeah, shop shop, like, okay, when you're in Cape Town, no, I was with my group. When you're in Soweto, no, shop shop, shop shop. Yeah, and, yeah, you know? Yeah. And the last one is now now. What do you understand by the term now now? I call you. Yeah. And you, can you? <laughs> If a South African says they're coming or they're going to do something now, now, you might understand it as, okay, my time right now. But now, now, actually, in South Africa, forget about it right now. It can be two days later. It could be two days later. It could be an hour from this, but it's, yeah, it's not now. And the way they'll say, like, okay, I'm up. I'm there now, 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 now. You're thinking, okay, this person is going to be here in two minutes. I mean, five days later. So when a South African says that to you guys, that they're going to do something for you now, 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 now or they're coming, okay. now, now, it does not mean now. We understand what the term now means. It, it's not a sense of urgency, I should say. No, it sounds very urgent, but, but not just I mean, we even oh. emphasize now, now. <laughs> we do we put two, it's like down and now. <laughs> now, now, but it's not happening anytime soon. Yeah. Well, guys, we have come to the end of this video. Yeah. We hope you loved and enjoyed it. Yo, man, what you guys think about this video, man? Give this video a like if you appreciate them giving us a little slang, you know what I'm saying, to understand the South African lingo. But, um, yeah, man, we're on the road to 6K subs. We're almost there. We're like 100 away. So if y'all new to the channel, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Comment below. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. It's your boy Breezy. Everything easy, sir. Peace. Paving this shit, crack.